Hi guys, I'm Smita and welcome back to my channel where I talk about all things AI and machine learning related. In today's video, we'll be looking at an API created by Assembly AI, which makes use of machine learning and natural language processing to automatically identify chapters in videos and audios. Before we get started, let's actually understand what exactly is natural language processing and why is this such a big deal? Natural language processing is the science of making machines and programs understand human language the same way that we do. So by looking at speech, by looking at text, or even from audios and videos, by being actually able to understand what exactly is being said, similar to how we process our own language, that is the art of natural language processing. So it's safe to say that natural language processing is a really big aspect of machine learning. In fact, a lot of important products out there make use of natural language processing, with Google search being one of the biggest examples. Now, a lot of the state of the art uh, natural language processing models like uh, BERT, they're actually highly focused on text. In fact, a lot of traditional natural, natural language processing models are focused on text. However, by looking at the large majority of data that we have in the world out there on the internet, we see that a lot of data is in the form of videos and audios. So it's extremely important that we have natural language mo processing models, which are also able to process videos and audios and extract useful information out of them as well. So this is exactly where Assembly AI's API comes in. Assembly AI has built an API which makes use of a really high level machine learning and natural language processing model. And this model is highly optimized for video and audio format in order to extract features from video and audio. We can make use of this API to extract a ton of different features from both audio and video data. And in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how you can use this API in order to extract chapters from a video. And after that, I'm going to show you guys a bunch of amazing projects that you guys can actually use this API in order to build. So these projects can be very useful for your portfolio as a machine learning engineer. And also these are some really amazing natural language processing projects that you can definitely add to your portfolio. As an example, we are going to be looking at this video of President Biden's first address to Congress, and we're going to be extracting chapters out of this automatically by using the assembly AI API. In order to get the chapters, we're going to write a short Python script in order to use this API. So let's get started. The first thing we're going to do is import the request library. And also I'm importing a file called constants. The constants.py file is where you guys can store your API key. The next thing we're going to write is the headers for our request command, and that will include our API key as well as the type of content that we want, which is we want to be able to get a JSON file in return. And next we have our input data for our request command, which includes the URL for the audio that we want to transcribe and get chapters out of. And we are going to put auto chapters equals to true because that's what we want to generate. And then we are going to call request.post and make use of the assembly AI API link uh, along with the headers we have created and the data. Once we've done that, we're going to output that into a JSON file. Our JSON file of our output should look something like this, where it includes a bunch of chapters. Uh, at what point in time does the chapter start and at what point does it end along with a summary of the chapter? as well as a headline for each chapter. Once you guys actually extract your JSON file into something more meaningful, we can look at chapters like this. So you would have the exact timestamp of the beginning of each chapter and also the title and summary of each chapter as well. You guys can find the code for how to use this API in the documentation for assembly AI's API, which I'll be leaving in the description box below. Next up, let's see how auto chapters actually works. Like how does this feature actually work? Well, auto chapters feature is actually implemented by a set of really powerful machine learning models. 
the first machine learning model is used to actually segment the audio file into chapters. And it does this by detecting a change in topics. So the main machine learning algorithm is able to detect changes in topics. And then that's when it knows that the next chapter has begun and the previous chapter has ended. The second machine learning model then summarizes this chapter data into bite-sized summaries and also generates titles for it as well. Next up, let's look at what are some of the best use cases for this API. So you guys can actually use this auto summary feature in order to actually create better search algorithms, because now you can use this auto summary feature in order to create summaries and chapters for videos and audios, and you're able to generate such algorithms for both videos and audios as well. And if you're a creator on a platform like YouTube, you could use this to automatically generate chapters for your video. So you wouldn't have to manually go through your video in order to identify at what point are the chapters actually beginning. There are a ton of other use cases as well, such as using it for long video lectures and other formats where you would want a summary instead of having to go through the entire thing, or also to be easily able to search for exactly what you're looking for in a really long video. That is such a helpful tool. Let me know what you guys thought about this video and what do you plan on building with assembly AI's API? I will be leaving the links for the API's documentation in the description box below. Thank you guys for watching and see you in my next video.